Reed offers the Hole Master, a hole cutting tool designed to cut up to four and a half inch diameter into steel pipe. The hole size allows for use of all standard style pipe fittings on branching, unpressurized pipelines. In addition, the Hole Master has a maximum capacity of 10 inch pipe. Ideal for mechanical, industrial maintenance, and fire protection contractors, the Hole Master comes complete with a base, chain, and screw for clamping, a plate, and drill holder. This quick, two-piece design allows for easy assembly, operation, and transport. The Hole Master is designed to work in conjunction with several popular half-inch chuck drills. The Milwaukee 1660-1 and 1660-6 the DeWalt DW131 spade handle drill and the DeWalt DC987KA cordless drill. Prior to operating any reed equipment, carefully read the enclosed instructions. Also, reed recommends the use of OSHA approved eyewear and safety clothing. Begin by assembling the drill to the drill adapter. Next, Assemble the mounting plate to the drill adapter. Set the drill press housing on the pipe to the desired location for hole cutting. Attach the chain around the pipe and secure in the chain lock. Tighten the chain with the chain handle assembly. Load the mounting pipe with the drill holder and the Milwaukee drill into the hole master housing and secure tightly with the mounting plate screw. Screw the reed hole saw onto the arbor. Set the one quarter inch center drill into the arbor and tighten. The center drill should be set one half inch past the end of the hole saw. Insert the hole saw and arbor into the drill chuck and tighten. Plug in the electric power drill. With one hand on the hole master, loosen the mounting plate. The hole master is now assembled and ready for cutting. Directly pilot drill to the desired point for drilling. Squeeze the drill power switch and begin center drilling. Apply a steady feed with the drill arm until the hole saw begins cutting. Note, the use of lubrication will ease cutting. Upon cutting through the inside of the pipe, back off the hole saw with counter direction of the housing handle arm. Shut off the electric power drill. The hole saw will hold a steel coupon, which may be hot. Take caution when removing this coupon. Remove the drill and mounting plate assembly from the hole master housing and set in a safe area. This concludes the step-by-step -step setup and operation of the Reed Hole Master. Please refer to your Hole Master Operator's Manual for reference on the use of this tool and its accessories.